Will you tell me about your first day at Long Grower Lawn? Um, yeah, I was really excited. Um, we were obviously put in the same form class, but it actually turned out to be a really great class and I think it was good crack over the form class of five years. I was quite excited to go in. I was kind of ready for the transition from a smaller primary school to a bigger secondary school. You were coming in with people you knew and even if you didn't know people, it was just so welcoming. I was quite nervous about managing like the workload because obviously it's a big change from primary school to the new subject. But I think the teachers were really supportive. And uh, there's like a good connection with the students and the teachers and students with other students as well. The older years are nice and they're really helpful at times where yeah. things are in like the first couple of weeks. And I just felt like Lauren Grammar was really encouraging and I just thought this is a lovely environment. You just kind of know everybody, which I think is quite nice. It can be seen as quite a small school. If I walk to my next class, I know like so many people yeah. in the corridor. The school yeah. is quite a nice community feeling. Pupils are able to chat to their teachers, not feel scared to go up to them and ask them something. And you can just go ask anybody and they would totally help you out, pupil or staff member. It's just so nice to know that there's somebody out there who can help you. Hey, what changes have you found when moving up the school? More maybe freedom or respect. Some people would have a closer bond with teachers, haven't been with them for longer. Yeah, definitely it's it's more personal I would say. Yeah, I agree with the thing on class size. You definitely build more of a rapport with the teacher um, and the class even. And there's more of a, a mutual respect between you and the teachers because you've chosen their subject and they are wanting to help you through it as much as they can. They want you to succeed. What are you? It's um, subject. Oh, definitely technology has been since first year. Yeah. I just love like being in the workshop and making things and being creative. I love that. Maths is one of those things that such an edible mass, it can be quite tricky to get right, but once you do get it right, it's quite rewarding. There's always an answer, right? and there's always like, a right answer. Yeah, yeah I always enjoy the sciences with different practicals and learning new things that I didn't think that even existed until I came here. And music, I know why, but when I, I came into first year, I was like, I really want to give music a shot. I gave it a shot, and I ended up like really enjoying it, and I still do lots of music. I love HGE because we get to cook and I think it's a great experience just to get used to being in the kitchen and learning some basic skills and art. It's just fun to go in and design stuff and express yourself through art. I love PA. I think it's just like the opportunities that we get from hockey and stuff. Uh, Charlie, what do you think the best part of Long Grammar is? I think the best part is being with your friends all day, every day. For me, I think it's that although the internal curricular is very good, the extracurricular is very good as well. So what's on offer that's not school-based as such? So things like the charity committee and literary leaders and things like that, and even mentoring and school council, where we are interacting more and getting the thoughts of like the younger years and even the older years sometimes. After school, just you get to do sports and stuff like hockey, the boys who work bit. Boys also do cricket in summers, athletics. Yeah. Being part of rugby is great. You train like a, a professional team nearly. You know, every day, March and Saturday, gives you something to look forward to. I think more recently I quite enjoyed watching the musical. I think it was like really comedic for everybody. <laughs> it would have to be a musical. Just the end, like the end of each production. It was that feeling when we were standing as a cast and like there was a stand ovation going on. Like you can't, you just can't beat that feeling. And I just felt so proud of like everyone in the cast, like the new friends I'd made from different years.